本日ご登壇いただきますのは岩田光夫さんそして佐々木望さんですどうぞ大きな拍手でお迎えください So we are going to welcome the stars and voice actors of Akira Our guests will be Nozomi Sasaki and Mitsuo, Mr. Mitsuo Iwata. Thank you very much. So, if we could start with a word or two from each of you to the, to the audience, please. Thank you. 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 Uh, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining us this afternoon.、Uh, my name is Mitsuo Iwata, and I play,、uh, I voice、uh, acted Kaneda、uh, in Akira, and I look forward to our, our time together. Thank you. Tetsuo Yakuo and Jimashita, Sasaki Nozomu desu. Honjit wa go raijo itadaki, ありがとうございました Mina san ni d a i s c r e e n de Akira wa mite itadaki de totemo u r e s h i desu. Kyo wa yoroshiko nae itashimasu. My name is Nozomu Sasaki, and I play Tetsuo in the film. And I'm so glad to have you all uh, see uh, Akira on such a wonderful、uh, large screen. And I do、uh, look forward to our time together. Thank you very much for coming. Uh, so, uh, it was a wonderful presentation. It seems we had,、uh, we had the audience kind of clapping wildly after、uh, the screening. のの and can our, both,、uh, can our voice actors both tell us、um, when was the last time、uh, you have been together or have shared the stage like this for an Akira presentation? それがですね、はいあの実はあのアキラの上演、当時最初に上演した頃にあの一緒になって以来多分もう30年ぶりにアキラのイベントとしては、ね、あの2人で同時に参加するのは初めて。So, it actually has been 30 years since we last shared the stage like this for an Akira presentation. The last time we did this kind of thing was、um, back when it was released 30 years ago. じゃあとっても貴重な場に今日お客様いらっしゃるってことですね。私たちにとっても非常に貴重なあの岩田さんとアキラでステージに登壇できるっていうのは、あこの令和の時代にですね、本当に感動しています。平成何やってたんだって話
And I thought, well, this is going to be uh, bring quite a lot of work for maybe us voice actors as well, who were cast in Akira. Uh, and for Mr. Sasaki, he said, uh, but uh, it was set in such a distant future for us when we first saw it or when we first created it. So I really had, uh, little had I imagined that the uh, times or real life would actually catch up with, with uh, what was depicted in, in Akira. やっぱりさすがに当時はそういったことは全く頭にも先のことでまた私たちもすごく若かったのでそんな先のことなんてやっぱ考えないですよねとても uh, both of our voice actors has really uh, not foreseen this happening. Uh, uh, first of all, Tokyo hosting the 2020 Olympics, but also uh, from Mr. Sasaki Hira, my imagination only extended to 1999. And I really didn't uh, put a lot of thought or think of or imagine much about what would be happening in, uh, happening in the 21st century because that was that seems so distant uh, in the future. But we were uh, very being very young. Uh, we really didn't think about the distant future like that. ま、今あの、少しお話ありましたけれども、ま、あの、当時はオッタ方若手の俳優さんという、ま、立ち位置で、で、実際この作品に参加するきっかけというのはどういったところだったんですか。オーディションですね。そうなんですね。やっぱり
so uh, for Mr. Sasaki, first of all, we had, uh, I don't really clearly uh, remember having had to do uh, up to three auditions between uh, before we did the chemistry uh, together, but um, I, I do remember that uh, Mr. Ivanta was already a veteran child actor by then, so I knew him quite well through his work, um, but I do remember him, I, I do remember that uh, I knew that we were quite close uh, age-wise. Uh, uh, on the other hand, I myself uh, was only, uh, had only made my debut one year uh, prior to that, so I really didn't know anything, and I didn't know about the casting process with uh, voice actors for animation works like this. So uh, I just said, yes, 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 and I kind of stumbled, I seem to have stumbled into my role. Uh, it would might be a little flippant to, to say that I was lucky, but uh, in any case, I am very, very thankful uh, to have uh, been able to play this role. And for Mr. Iwata, uh, he says, when uh, I met my, um, my co-actor, he said, I'm, going, I'm, I'm Sasaki, and I'm going to be playing Tetsuo. And the first moment I heard his voice, I thought, this it was very convincing. It really sounded like Tetsuo, and I thought, what a perfect voice actor to play the part. It was perfect casting. Uh, I have, it, the, those are one of the memories that I have. Again, from Mr. Sasaki, he, he, uh, we have. Um, I was just very excited uh, to see uh, Mr. Iwata because, again, I had seen his animation and I was seeing the real voice actor uh, right in front of me. Uh, so I, would, I remember really looking forward to the process because I knew that it was going to be a very long uh, dubbing uh, process. And I just remember uh, having to, uh, just being determined to uh, put all of my uh, sweat and toil and passion uh, into my role. あの、多くの方から指示をされていて、で、今日もね、外国からのお客様もたくさんいらっしゃってますけれども、海外でも大人気で、その日本のアニメーションを語るにおいて、絶対に外せない作品の一つであることは間違いないんですけれども、その制作
何度も何度も月に1回とか2月に1回とかちょっとずつ撮っていったんですがその間にその「アキラを制作しているっていうのが我々の業界の中でも話題になったりとかしてよく言われたんですねあの先輩方とかね「お前アキラ出てんだって」って「いつできるの?」みたいな感じでそれであ本当にあの皆さんにあの注目されている。作品なんだなっていうのがどんどんその自分もあのインプットされると今度は逆にさあどうするかってもうベテランさんばっかりでほぼ自分があのもうね去年デビューしたばっかりのような自分がいてこの方たちの中でどうやってあの哲夫っていうメインの役をやっていくかなっていうまた今度そこで自分は自分の作業の中にあの集中するようになったので。実際その外の,外の箱の大きさは結局分かんないままにあの夢中でやっていって収録終わったという感じでした。あ、そう、from Mr. Sasaki we have、uh, I really as I just mentioned before I kind of really stumbled、uh, into the part so、uh, really for me it was just trying to do the task that was put right in front of me、uh, I wasn't really aware of or I was quite oblivious to the fact <laughs> That this project that we were doing,、uh, Akira, was such a big box, let's say. And I was just working in my own、uh, realm, let's say.、Um, and the, uh, as uh, was mentioned, uh, we, we went through a、uh, so called pre scoring or pre recording process.、Uh, and that took more than one year. And so we would go back and forth to and from the studio、uh, one time a month or, or one,、uh, once in two months and so forth. And, and that took、uh, more than a year. But I do remember. Uh, people talking about the fact within the industry,、uh, people were talking about it, and、uh, my senpai would come to me and say,、uh, and tell me that, or mention the fact that, hey,、uh, I heard that you're being cast、uh, for this Akira、uh, project. So I、uh, slowly began to realize what a big commotion this was causing.、Uh, and of course, there were again trepidations about acting with these wonderful veteran actors while I had only made my debut、uh, the previous year.、Uh, and it really made me think、uh, anew. How I was to approach this,、uh, this part of、uh, Tetsuo. But again, I was quite oblivious to, to the fact that it was such a big project. I think that the first thing that I have to do is to be able to do it. I think that the first thing that I have to do is to be able to do it. I think that the first thing that I have to do is to be able to do it. 面白かったのがあの事前に台本とものすごい量の絵コンテを渡されて、はい、でこれ見といてくれって言って、はい、大友さんの手書きの絵コンテだと思って贅沢ですね贅沢いやすごいそれまあもらいたかったんですけど回収されちゃったんじゃないんですけども<笑>残念<笑>あれあったらすごかったねお宝ですよね<笑>すごかったねでそれを一枚一枚実はあのビデオにこう撮ってで実際そのアフレコ現場のスタジオに入ると大友さんが、えー、ここからこの台本のここからここまでのシーンというのは絵コンテでこう,こういうシーンになりますこうやってこうやって、えー、絵は動いていきますじゃあやりましょうって言ってマイク前に立ってだから絵はない中で想像さっき見せられたものを想像しながらだからまあラジオドラマ風にだから結局自分の間になってくるというか、はい、絵の間じゃなくて自分の間でお芝居をさせていただくという非常に贅沢な撮り方をさせていただきますそれで絵ができてそこまで撮ったものが完成するまで一旦お休みになってでまた先に進みましょうという非常に亀の歩みのような形であの結局あのもちろん毎日撮ってるわけじゃなくてそうやって間間を込めあの。休んで取ってってやると、結果一年半以上、一年以上かかってしまったという、そういう形ですね。あ,あ、そうなんですね。はい、佐々木さんは、覚えてらっしゃいます。はい、えっ、ー、と、そのアニメ、普通のアニメだと、あの、まず絵ができていて、その絵に我々がこう、声を当てるっていうんですけども。その絵はもう、すでにその、例えば、どこで、ブレスっていうんですけど、どこで切って、セリフ切って、どこでまた喋り出してとか。それから、全体の尺っていうんですけど、長さ。が決まっていてだからその長さに合わせないとあのまだ喋ってても口は閉じてるとか逆に口がまだパクパク言ってもこっちは喋り終わるっていうその調整をするのが普通のアニメの収録なんですがそのプレスコっていうのは先に声を取るのでその制限が全然なかったんですねだから岩田さんもおっしゃったように自由に
で例えばどんな言い方をしてほしいとか特にその個別の指示もほとんどいただかなかったように思います本当に自由にさせていただいて思った通りに思った抑揚と思った間合いと思ったテンポで話すことができたのがすごく役に集中しやすかったですしまたスタジオは基本的にあの足,足音とか立てられないんですけどもでもあの天井の高いスタジオで割とこうこの動いたりとかもねしてた,してたのでなんかちょっとそのスタジオの中はなんとなくこう演劇としてあの俳優としてまあ舞台じゃないですが舞台に立ってるような感じで小劇場みたいな感じでそこに大友さんがいらしてあの監督してくださるという。なんか本当にこう言えば言うほどなんて贅沢だったんだ。本当だよね。<笑>贅沢だな。どうしよう。はい。あ、so again this was quite a、uh, peculiar well, well quite a、uh, an unusual process.、Uh, the voice、uh, acting process was quite unusual.、Uh, and、uh, from Mr. Iwata we have、um, sorry from Mr. Sasaki we have the、uh, he says the so as as we mentioned it was a so-called pre-scoring process we where we would do the、um, do our voices first and after that would would come the visual and so the way uh, in uh, we were the way that we worked、uh, with that was we would have the script and then we would have Mr Otomo's handwritten storyboarding and this was a lot. Of, of sheets, and I, I wish I could have kept that、uh, all of them for my own, which it would have been very valuable. But、um, they collected、uh, the storyboarding in the end, and、uh, we would do take by take.、Um, our director would say, "So we are going to shoot this scene today," and、uh, and he would sh- he would show us the storyboarding, and we were able to imagine what scene we were enacting as we stood in front of our mics and、uh, did our voices. And so, <laughs> ごめんなさい失礼しました。And so it was like、uh, doing a radio drama.、Uh, we were able to kind of enjoy our own little booths, our own atmospheres, our own timing.、Uh, and so we would do little patches like this. And we wouldn't be going to the studio every day, but、uh, we would do patches and then take a rest and then do another patch and take a rest. And so that's why it、uh, took more than one year、uh, to do the whole of、uh, the、uh, voice acting. And for Mr. Sasaki, we have、um, the、uh, usually with animation, the visuals come first, and then the voice acting comes. After that, we do、uh, what they call a、uh, fudeko.、Uh, so the voice actors ma- try to match the visuals、uh, when they do their acting,、uh, and so there's a lot of details that you have to pay attention to in that kind of process because、uh, we, you don't want to be、uh, saying any dialogue while the characters have already closed their mouths and so forth. So、uh, there's a lot of、uh, calculation that has to go in that.、Uh, for this one, we were able to do our voices quite, quite freely、uh, at. Uh, in, uh, beforehand, so there wasn't a lot of meticulous direction,、uh, and so we were able to be quite creative and spontaneous in the way we would、uh, do the highs and lows of the tone of our voice and the pacing and, our, and the tempo and whatnot.、Uh, and so we were really able to concentrate on our characters and concentrate on our acting.、Uh, usually, when you're working in a studio, you can't、uh, you you can't make any sounds with your feet and so forth. But luckily, we were working in a studio that had had a very high ceiling, so it was as if we were. Playing on、uh, stage as stage actors, and we had our director, Mr. Otomo, there, and so it was a very rich and rare experience for both of us. 本当にあの今見ても全くねその時代を感じないっていうんでしょうか。むしろ今見ても新しさを感じるようなそういった作品の位置づけになるんじゃないかなと思うんですけれども、本当にあの今日は皆さん貴重な機会だったのではないかと思います。えー、それではですね、はい。Uh, so, uh, all of this、uh, technology that went into it,、uh, the technique that went into it,、uh, I suppose, results in the fact that you can see Akira now and it doesn't seem outdated、uh, at all.、Um, but、uh, we would like to once again thank you,、uh, thank both of our guests for such a wonderful and rare occasion. それではですねもうちょっと時間の方ももっともっとお話を伺いたいところではあったんですけれども時間の方も迫ってまいりましたので最後にですね今日せっかくお二方にお越しいただきましたので彼らと鉄をとして何かこう一言いただけたらなと思うんですけれどもいかがでしょうパフォーマンス、はい、I think we are going to be seeing a little reenactment of a certain scene from Akira so both as Kaneda and Tetsuo いきますかはいこれからは俺がお前を助けてやるそん時はいいなカネちゃんよ
。サウンをつけろよ、デコスケやろう。ありがとうございました。ありがとうございました。I'm wondering if I should translate that. <laughs> the line is very, my very poor translation would be、uh, next time I'm going, to be the, I'm going to be the one to help you, Kaneda. It's Mr. Kaneda to you, you big forehead, or something like that. <laughs> いやもう二人のやり取りがすべてこう目の前にね浮かんできたのではないでしょうか。ありがとうございました。どうぞ改めて拍手をお願いします。Thank you once again, Thank you very much. 岩田光雄さん、佐々木望さん、どうもありがとうございました。どうぞ大きな拍手でお送りくださいませ。Once again, a warm round of applause for our guests, Mr. 望佐々木 and Mr. 光雄岩田 Thank you very much.